<laughs> it is a very popular show, and now you can see a local version of the Masked Singer offer a good cause. Yeah, we've got Nicole here from the Salvation Army. Joe is here from Tweet Garrett. They're supporting this event. And we have whoever, oh yes, whoever this person is right here. You won't be able to find out just yet anyway. All right, Nicole, let's start by talking about this event. It's called the Costumed Caroler. What's right. happening so that night? To kick off our Christmas campaign for the Salvation Army, <laughs> we decided that we wanted to have an event that would be really fun for the public to come and attend and just really energize the kickoff to our campaign okay. and start the fundraising. So. We decided that um, we would do a little play on the Mass Singer, and so we're holding an event called the Costume Caroler, and that'll be on November 12th from 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. at Riverside Ballroom. Gingerbread Lady really wants to get in the action here. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who she is, but. <laughs> don't talk a bit about your role in not only this event, but the season as a whole. Yeah, I mean, Tweet Queer, it's uh, thrilled to be a presenting sponsor for this event. What a great way to get involved, have some fun, raise some money for a great, uh, great charity. So, Nicole, I know you can't give out names or anything, but, like, <laughs> who will be the masked singers? Uh, was there any, like, thought going in of they should be able to sing or? <laughs> um, no singing skills okay. required. Okay. Just, um, just the courage to get out there and have a good time. So we have um, quite a few. At, we have nine local celebrities. Nine people. Um, that have signed up to participate which we are thrilled, um, and obviously we can't reveal, reveal any of their identities, but that's going to be part of the fun that night. You're going to get mm. to um, watch their performances and vote on performances, but also try and guess who you might who might be inside of that costume. Uh-huh. Interesting. Now, this really does kick off a season of giving and the things that Salvation Army is so well known for. Talk about some of the programming that this is going to help really raise awareness of and help fund. Right. So our Christmas campaign is our biggest fundraiser of the year. Um, but money raised during the Christmas campaign um, doesn't just go towards things that happen at the Christmas season, but they help support our programming and our services that happen year-round at the Salvation Army. Um, so obviously during Christmas season you're familiar with things like our Christmas distribution where we're helping people with toys and with food and things like that. But year-round we also have uh, services like our food pantry and our noon lunch program and our transitional housing program, things like that. So funds raised during the Christmas season um, go to support those services year-round. I, mean, I want to know if this is actually like one of the people who's going to... I'm we'll obsessed here. I'm kind we'll of obsessed know. here with the, with the uh, <laughs> gingerbread <laughs> lady. <laughs> it's a Joel, secret. Do you think like, are you guys going to have some people there? Or are you going to... I guess you can't really reveal yeah. if one of them is going to be a mass Singer, but you know. I, I can't it say. could be Joe. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, I know. Who knows? I can tell you we'll be there. We have a yeah. table. We're looking forward to having an evening of fun with the, the Salvation Army. Right. And this is something so different. Nobody's right. really done this. Right. It is. Uh, we'd like to think, obviously, that it's a unique event, mm -hmm. and we're hoping that people are going to be excited to come and check it out, and they're going to want to come and try and figure out who is inside these costumes. So if people are interested, tickets are available right now online. Um, you can find them at <laughs> sagreenbay.org. Um, individual tickets are for sale, and there are still some corporate uh, tables um, available, and also mm -hmm. sponsorships are still available. So if anyone is interested, head to sagreenbay.org and check that out. Is it like the audience is voting for who? I mean, yes. that's, I'm just like curious how it's yeah. going to work. So anybody that attends the event is going to get the opportunity to vote on the performances, and we'll kind of um, whittle those down to the top performances and, um, and declare a winner at the end. Oh, it's, oh, she, <laughs> she or he, I'm not even sure, is already saying they're the winner. Is it going to be like the mass Singer then? The thing comes down and they do like yes. the sing <laughs> Yes, it's, it's going to be a good time. So. All right, well, uh, hopefully you will come on out because this is a great way mm -hmm. to kick off the Salvation Army Christmas season, which actually supports them year-round. The Costume Caroler event, Tuesday, November 12th from 5 to 8. This is all happening at Riverside <laughs> Ballroom in Green Bay. Get your tickets at sagreenbay.org. Thank you all. Thank Good luck, you. Gingerbread Woman, man. <laughs>